This analysis delves into the intricate challenges surrounding the Raptor engines, particularly the Raptor Vacuum Engine, RVAC, on the Starship spacecraft. Starship's complexity necessitates substantial time to achieve the reliability of Falcon rockets. The engines crucial to the spacecraft's function pose significant engineering hurdles requiring ongoing refinement. Recent flight tests have exposed critical issues with the RVAC on both the Starship upper stage and the Super Heavy booster, highlighting significant challenges in achieving full operational capability. These failures underscore the demanding nature of deep space exploration, requiring detailed analysis and meticulous engineering solutions to fully realize Starship's potential. The intricate interconnectedness of the propulsion system necessitates precise solutions to prevent cascading failures, ensuring reliability for future missions. The significant investment and resources dedicated to Starship underscore the importance of overcoming these hurdles. Flight 7 of Starship exhibited RVAC malfunctions, while Flight 8 revealed more severe problems, including small fires on the engine cooling manifolds. This resulted in exceeding safe temperature limits and potential leaks or blockages within the cooling system were identified. Analysis points to the engine feed line system as the likely source. The newly implemented vacuum insulation system on Starship Vi-2 might be exacerbating vibrations in the feed lines, increasing the risk of damage. The interplay between these components and the demands of spaceflight underscores the complexities of maintaining structural integrity and thermal control in extreme environments. Further investigation is needed to pinpoint the exact cause, encompassing a detailed examination of the interactions between the feed lines, insulation, and the engine's operating parameters. These issues highlight the intricate engineering challenges inherent in designing a reusable, deep space vehicle. These malfunctions triggered a chain reaction of engine failures, ultimately leading to loss of control and explosions. Currently, only a limited number of RVAC engines are functioning. SpaceX faces the crucial task of resolving these issues to achieve the reliability needed for deep space missions. The impact on Starship's thrust capability is significant, and without a functional, robust engine system, the entire mission is compromised. This highlights the importance of a comprehensive understanding of not only the immediate cause, but also the cascading effects within the complex system. The implications extend beyond the immediate failure. These events underscore the fragility of such systems operating in extreme conditions and the need for thorough testing and robust redundancy measures. Successful future missions hinge on addressing these issues, and the potential loss of valuable mission time underscores the urgency of finding a solution. SpaceX is actively pursuing solutions to mitigate these critical Raptor engine issues. Potential improvements include advanced fire suppression systems capable of swiftly extinguishing abnormal flames and optimized venting mechanisms to prevent excessive pressure buildup during leaks. Structural reinforcement to enhance stability and reduce vibrations impacting fuel feed lines is also crucial. A thorough evaluation of the fuel delivery system is essential, identifying and correcting any design flaws that might contribute to the failures. Moreover, the need for refining the fuel temperature regulation system cannot be overstated, as precise thermal control is vital in preventing material stress and component degradation. The consideration and implementation of the Raptor 3 engine, offering higher thrust and greater reliability through simplified design and improved active cooling systems, is a major potential solution. The development and testing of Raptor 3, while promising, are complex and time-consuming. All these enhancements represent a multi-pronged approach to addressing the multifaceted nature of the problem and restoring the reliability of the Raptor engines, particularly the RVAC for future missions. The Raptor 3 engine, though promising, faces significant integration challenges and a complex timeline for deployment on a Starship flight. Flight 9 becomes a critical testbed for the effectiveness of the implemented improvements on the Starship V2 including verifying the reliability of crucial components and systems. This includes replicating and advancing proven technologies from previous missions, but also evaluating new ones within the context of the V2 architecture. The flight will provide invaluable data on the performance of the RVAC under various conditions, particularly during ascent and re-entry. Successful completion of tasks like payload deployment, in-space engine relight, 
and controlled landings is paramount. The results, whether positive or negative, are critical in determining the efficacy of the changes made to mitigate past failures and to move towards a higher level of operational capability. These evaluations will provide the necessary feedback loop for refinement and adaptation, crucial for future missions, like complex payload deployments and in-orbit refueling operations. Thorough analysis of each mission phase will be paramount in the long-term success and advancement of the Starship program. The Starship S-35 and B-16 prototypes, incorporating the latest refinements, will be crucial test beds for these improvements. Their performance in subsequent testing will directly impact the future trajectory of the Starship program. Successful completion of their cryogenic tests and engine installations will set the stage for rigorous evaluations of the entire system. The focus is now on ensuring the effective integration of Raptor vacuum engine upgrades and other improvements prior to Flight 9. Overcoming the challenges of the Raptor engine, particularly the RVAC, is essential for SpaceX to realize its ambitious space exploration goals. The challenges in ensuring the reliability of the engines and the broader system are substantial and must be meticulously addressed. The successful integration of these refinements will be vital to the overall success and operational viability of the Starship spacecraft. The results of these tests will dictate the future of the Starship program, determining whether the current design can withstand the rigors of deep space missions and maintain long-term reliability. Ultimately, the success of these upgrades will shape the future of the program, driving the development of a reusable, reliable spacecraft for advanced space exploration. This analysis highlights the significant challenges and opportunities facing SpaceX in developing the Starship spacecraft. The ongoing issues with the Raptor engines, especially the RVAC, demand rigorous solutions and comprehensive testing. The future of the program hinges on overcoming these hurdles to achieve a fully reliable and reusable spacecraft capable of complex deep space missions. The analyses of previous flight data, coupled with the upcoming tests on the S-35 and B-16 prototypes, will be crucial in determining the efficacy of the implemented upgrades and the overall stability of the Starship system. The progress in refining the engine technology, as well as integrating other improvements, will directly impact the future trajectory of the program. Successful future flights will be paramount in determining the effectiveness of the solutions and whether they can sustain the demands of future missions. Thorough data analysis and continuous refinement of both the engine and the entire Starship system will be critical to achieving SpaceX's ambitious goals in space exploration, including complex endeavors like payload deployment, in-space refueling, and controlled landings. Ultimately, the reliability of the Starship system and the successful execution of future missions will depend on the effective resolution of these core engineering challenges. SpaceX inaugurates two new Starship engine test stands with a static fire. SpaceX has inaugurated two new state-of-the-art Starship engine test stands in McGregor, Texas, just four months after groundbreaking. This significant expansion allows the company to test more Raptor engines than its existing Falcon 9 and Falcon Heavy engines. This capacity boost is crucial as SpaceX transitions to more complex orbital test flights of the six-engine Starship and 29-engine Super Heavy boosters. The shift demands extensive engine qualification through static fire tests. All 35 engines required for these upcoming orbital tests will need to undergo rigorous testing in McGregor. The new test stands represent a critical step forward in SpaceX's ability to meet the rapidly increasing demands of the Starship and Super Heavy development programs. This expanded testing capacity will allow SpaceX to maintain its ambitious development and launch schedules. The enhanced capability to test these engines is vital for the progress and success of future missions. SpaceX's current Raptor testing facilities face capacity limitations, especially given the increased demands of the Starship and Super Heavy programs. The existing Merlin test stands used for Falcon rocket engines have been overwhelmed by production, creating substantial delays. The new Starship test stands are designed to alleviate these bottlenecks, enabling simultaneous testing and development. The previous capacity constraints for qualifying Raptor engines likely significantly impacted the overall program timeline. The new stands will significantly reduce the time required for this crucial engine qualification process. 
potentially shrinking the lead time by two-thirds compared to the previous process. This improvement is crucial for maintaining the fast-paced development in near-monthly launch cadence SpaceX aims to maintain. The substantial increase in testing capacity is key to SpaceX's ability to scale production and testing efficiently. This will have a major impact on the program's overall timeline and efficiency. Construction of the dual bay test stands proceeded remarkably quickly, reaching operational status within an impressive 18 weeks. A brief 15-second static fire test confirmed the facility's readiness. This rapid construction and integration demonstrate SpaceX's efficiency in expanding testing capabilities. The speed of construction, from a bare dirt lot to a fully functional test stand, highlights SpaceX's logistical prowess and engineering efficiency. Aerial photos, meticulously documented by a NASA spaceflight contributor, offer a glimpse into the rapid progress, showcasing the rapid assembly of the complex structure and plumbing systems. This rapid development underscores the company's commitment to accelerating the testing process. The successful static fire test serves as a crucial validation of the new facility's readiness, confirming its capability to efficiently support the rigorous testing requirements of the Starship program. This achievement is a testament to SpaceX's exceptional capacity for rapid engineering and development. The new test stands represent a significant leap forward in SpaceX's ability to scale Raptor engine production and qualification, which is paramount for the continued development of Starship and Super Heavy. The substantially increased capacity promises a more rapid pace of launches, as the reduced time required for qualifying the 35 engines needed for orbital tests is a key factor in maintaining SpaceX's ambitious schedule. This expanded capacity allows for the potential for simultaneous experimental testing alongside the crucial qualification process. Crucially, this addresses a key bottleneck in engine development that has impacted past timelines. The faster rate of engine production and testing will directly impact the overall timeline for the Starship program, enabling more frequent and efficient launches. This enhanced capability to support ongoing experimental work is crucial for innovation and continuous improvement in engine technology, enabling SpaceX to address emerging challenges and refine engine performance. The reduced testing time will have a dramatic effect on the program's overall timeline, allowing for a faster development cycle and increased launch frequency. This improved efficiency will prove essential as the program progresses toward increasingly complex and ambitious missions. The ability to efficiently produce and test engines is crucial for maintaining SpaceX's ambitious development timeline and projected launch cadence.